Hello and welcome to Sharda e-learning educational video tutorials. We are going through chapter 1 of mathematics part 1 linear equation in two variables. Now we are going to see how to find solutions using graphical method. Okay, let's get into it. So, graphical method what is the graph of a linear equation? A linear equation has a graph of a straight line. Every linear equation, every linear equation in two variable is a straight line on a graph paper. For example, if we have the equation 2x minus y is equal to 4. This is a linear equation in two variable. So if we want to find the graph of the equation 2x minus y is equal to 4, we need to find some ordered pairs, some ordered pairs of these equations. So find to find the ordered pairs x, y, x comma y. So values of x, values of y and values of the ordered pair this is the table we have to find to find the straight line way straight line for the equation so if we put x is equal to 0 what we got y is equal to minus 4 okay so x is equal to 0 comma minus 4 similarly x is equal to y sorry uh, y is equal to 2 then we get the x is equal to so the or next ordered pair will be 2 comma 0 we can find more of ordered pair by putting different values like x is equal to 3 if we put the value of x is equal to 3 we get the value of y what is the value of y then 2 into 3 is equal to 6 6 minus y is equal to 4 minus y is equal to minus 2 y is equal to 2 so this is the third ordered pair so after getting the ordered pair in a table we will point we will draw these points on our graph paper we have a software here to point these graphs we will go through it so what is our line is 2x minus y is equal to 4 so this is the line you can see this is the line we can see x is equal to 0 when x is equal to 0 y is equal to minus 4 this is the point we have got first then second point was x is equal to 2 x is equal to 2 and y is equal to 0 this is the point second point and third point is x is equal to 3 and y is equal to 2 so we can notice all these points are in a straight line these all points are collinear when you join the two or three collinear points it will be a straight line so what we learned is every linear equation in two variable is a straight line each point on the straight line each point on the straight line similarly this is also a straight line point what is this point minus sorry one x, x value is one and y value is two one comma minus two if we check in the equation x one minus two y it will be satisfying the equation that means it is it is on the straight line of that equation so what is the point of drawing the graph is we want to find the solution of two or more equations of equation in two variables similarly if we have another equation x plus y is equal to 4 
this is the second the red line shows our equation number 2 which is a x plus y is equal to 4 we can notice here that these two straight lines are intersecting at one and only one point which is this so we can say that the point is available on both these points so it is satisfying both these linear equations so the point which is intersecting these two straight lines is a solution for them okay similarly we will take the another example for solving the equations by graphical method so this is the example 2x plus 3y is equal to 2 this is the equation number 1 and equation number 2 is 4x plus 3y is equal to 4 these are the two equations the system of linear equation we have to find a stable for this equation number 1 and also equation number 2 so let's find the table for equation number 1 okay value of x value of y and value of x minus y if we put value of x is equal to 1 what we got is value of y is equal to if we put the value of x is equal to 1 what is 2 it gets 2 and 2 minus 2 0 y is equal to 3 y is equal to 0 means y is equal to also 0 okay okay next uh, x is equal to 4 if we put x is equal to 4 we get the y is equal to minus 2 if we put the x is equal to 2 we can get the value y is equal to minus 2 so these ordered pairs are written as like this first write the value of x then value of y okay this is the two points we got for the equation number one similarly table number two table number two what x y x comma y if we put x is equal to one in equation number two this is this was for the equation number one okay this was for equation number one now we are calculating for equation number two equation number two okay if we put the x is equal to one we get the y is equal to zero you can calculate it by multiplying why we get the zero four into one four four minus four zero three y is equal to zero means y is equal to also zero okay now x is equal to put the x is equal to minus two if we put the x is equal to minus two we get uh, y is equal to four right so we got the ordered pair minus two comma minus four so in a straight line we have two two points that are sufficient to draw a straight line for confirmation you can get more ordered players three four five ordered players you can get to uh, be sure for your straight line is correct but two points are sufficient to draw a straight line so how to draw these straight lines you have to draw x axis y axis this is x this is y okay in the graph paper you can show horizontal line as a x axis and vertical as a y axis so uh, we uh, uh, point out these uh, ordered pair on the graph what are the points 1 comma 0 1 comma 0 is here okay and second point is 4 comma minus 2 4 is 1 2 3 4 4 comma minus 2 so somewhere here so these two points are for equation number 1 so if we join these two points if we join these two points we get the line for equation number 1 which is equation 2x plus 3y is equal to 2 this is the line this is the line for equation number 
one. Similarly, we have one uh, two more points. First is one comma zero, which is already we have no, and minus two comma four. Minus two is a x value, so uh, there should be here one minus one minus two uh, and four. Four is positive. Okay, that's why here. So we can find these two points on graph by drawing the by drawing the graph paper as like this. We have already drawn it for you. So this is the line for equation number one and equation number two. We can observe these two lines are intersecting at the point. 1 comma 0 at point 1 comma 0 where is 1 is x and 0 is y okay so we got an ordered pair which is intersecting at uh, which is an intersection point of two straight lines two equations we can check it with our software tool also so equation number one we have equation number one 2 x plus 3y is equal to is equal to 2 and second equation is 4x plus 3y is equal to 4 so we can check it out They are intersecting at sorry they are intersecting at point 1 comma 0 you can see the software help us to find straight lines directly by putting the equations but for manually doing it i have shown you how to do it the point the uh, point the ordered pairs on the graph and join them to find a straight line for each equation and then find the intersection point which is the 1 comma 0 so we can write so we can write we can write the point 1 comma 0 the point the point here 1 comma 0 is a ordered pair which is which satisfies both the equations so the two lines intersect at point one comma zero. Thus, the given pair. is solution for the given pair of linear equation have solution which is the solution x is equal to 1 and y is equal to 0 so x is equal to 1 and y is equal to 0 these are the solution so we can find these solutions by graphical methods by intersecting points okay so this is the solution of our equation so we will see uh, next method of finding the solution which is the Kramer's rule or determinant method in the next video thank you